Well, the new iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus went on sale for the first time today, and some Coast customers, in some cases, waited overnight for the chance to get Apple's latest gadget before it sold out. SNN's Grant Boxleitner has a closer look. Bigger screen uh, to start off with. Uh, it's lighter. Alonzo Maffei and son Chris lined up outside the AT&T store on Bee Ridge Road to be among the first to buy the new iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus. Uh, it's available. It won't be available uh, anytime soon later on. So we want to be the first in line to get here. Customer Sonny Hirschberg wanted to make sure they didn't run out. My phone is really old and it's really slow, so I just want a new one as soon as I can. And I'm scared that I'm not going to get one because they're on back order. AT&T area manager Zoran Jovic said he's been through this process with past iPhone unveilings. Well, we have plenty of staff today and as you know we were the uh, first carrier to carry the iPhone so we have plenty of practice. And this is the iPhone 6 Plus here and one of the new features helps you with multitasking so if you double click you can see all the apps you have open and you can involve people up here your contacts into these applications and when you're done you simply slide it up. And everyone waiting to get one is talking about the phone's new features. I know that the quality of like the screen is going to be a lot better, so I'm excited about that. Um, I'm excited about like the health and fitness app thing too. Three different colors in each device, so we have um, certain quantities in, in each one. Um, and uh, we're hoping it's going to be enough for our crowd. Reporting in Sarasota, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Suncoast News Network. Waiting in line. Well, if you could not get a new iPhone before they sold out, you can pre-order for the next shipment at a retailer or online.